So one of the cool parts about this museum, of course it's open air, it's outside, but every, these guys are up in the air like they're actually in flight. You can get close, you just have to be taller. I'm John D. Reinhardt. And I'm on a mission to explore California's rich aviation heritage from the dawn of flight right through to the space age by visiting the many California air museums. Today we're about 20 minutes south of Ventura and 20 minutes north of Malibu on the beautiful Pacific Coast Highway in Port Wainimi to visit the Point Magoo Missile Park. Here you'll find a McDonnell Douglas F4J Phantom II, a Grumman F14A Tomcat, and a Grumman EA6B Prowler. And while the Phantom Jet and the Tomcat are mounted high on stilts and a flight attitude, the Prowler sits down here on the deck. And while the two air superiority combat jets have their cockpit canopies blacked out, you can look right into the front office of this impressive electronics intelligence attack aircraft. You can see from the way she sits on her main gear, the Prowler's engine bays are empty. The Point Magoo Missile Park features a host of surface-to-air and surface-to-surface -surface missiles that were tested at the Point Magoo Missile Range, now called Naval Base Ventura County, including the Regulus and Regulus II guided missiles. This open-air museum opens at dawn and closes at dusk and is parked right next to the freeway on the Wood Road off-ramp near the entrance to the Navy base. It's open air, it's free, and it's truly awe-inspiring to come and visit these important historic aircraft. Oh, and one more thing as you get closer to Ventura, don't forget to take a look at the California Air National Guard base and those massive C-130 Hercules aircraft. 